Hi, it's Corrine for Cut at Home, and today we are making a greeting card. I'm using some black cardstock, and I'm making a 5x5 five five card. So I'm cutting this to 10 by 5 I will be using my Martha Stewart scoreboard and my stylus from the Heartfelt Creations Deluxe Flower Shaping Kit. I'm going to score it at five. Crease that with my bone folder. And now I'm going to pull some papers from the Simple Story Snap collection. For a mat on the front of my card. And I'm going to cut this so I leave myself a slight border. So I'm going to cut this to, I'm going to first try four and, probably four and seven eighths square, and I'll see if I like it there. That's perfect. And I think I'll use the polka dots. And now I'm going to use this Spellbinders Nest Abilities die. This is the Labels 49 die, and it comes with six dies in them. I've already used the first largest and second largest from this die and I cut it out from the same black cardstock. I cut it out four different times and layered them together so it gives it like a chipboard thickness but I decided I wanted a little bit thicker than that so I'm using some lightweight chipboard and this is very lightweight chipboard. It's, it's like cereal box material so I'm going to adhere it onto this and I'm also going to use the inside piece, the second largest, and cut out a middle portion from this. Now I'm going to use some Angel Craft one half inch tape. You can get this at um, on Amazon. I'll have a link on Cut at Home's blog. I pulled out this die set from Marianne Design Collectibles and this one is COL1378. I'll have a link over on Cut at Home's blog. I'm going to use this balloon and possibly these stamps.
I've pulled out the Marianne Design Creatables and it is a bow die. It has a top bow that has stars in it, the main bow and then the bottom of the bow and the part that wraps around the middle. So you can use it either with um, that top design part or not. This one is LR0326. Again, I will have a link for that. So here is the other card that I made. I made it similar way using the same paper collection, the Simple Stories Snap Collection. I added some enamel dots here. For the stamp, I used a beautiful stamp set from Joy Claire called Hugs and Smiles. And I used my Tim Holtz Distress Markers to color them in. For the Hello die, I used the Marianne Design Collectibles. This is a fun die set. It comes with two stamps, a checker and a stripe, so you can stamp them and then cut them out. I love this font. And again, using the Labels 49 die to do the same thing that I did. And I added a piece on the inside so I could write my greeting on as well. Please check out Cut at Home's blog. You'll find all the information on products used. And thanks so much for watching.